Hello everyone and welcome to episode 19 of the TCC CTC Link vlog. I'd like to start off this episode by congratulating Laura Chipman for being our episode 18 winner. She's been hosting Link down in marketing now for the past couple of weeks. Uh, and if you'd like your chance to host Link in your department, uh, we only have about three and a half months left. So stay tuned on Monday um, for the episode 19 question for your chance to host Link in your area. Uh, next, I'd like to kind of show a couple of uh, things that you'll be able to do in what's called the employee self-service uh, area of PeopleSoft. And this employee self-service area is actually housed in the HCM or human capital management pillar, which is where a lot of the HR information is housed. Um, so I'm going to navigate over here to, uh, this is the PeopleSoft uh, HCM sandbox. So it's not really, um, doesn't have a lot of configuration on the home page. Um, and you'll access the employee self-service uh, via a different route. But when I'm in this area, I can click on main menu and go to self-service. And under payroll and compensation, first thing I wanted to show was direct deposit. So with direct deposit in PeopleSoft, you'll actually be able to go in here and set up multiple bank accounts in the system and then set up the direct deposit and which and what percentages you'd like to go into each of the accounts that you've set up. So for instance, um, if I have a savings account and a checking account in here, I could say I want 25% of my saving or of my paycheck to go into savings and I want 75% of it to go into the checking account. So this is kind of a neat function uh, that we'll be able to access in the employee self-service side. Uh, the next tool I wanted to show is also in payroll and compensation and it's the voluntary deductions area. So in this area you'll actually be able to go in and, and um, so, so let's say for instance you wanted to add uh, some money to go to an, uh, an area in the combined fund drive. So maybe you wanted to donate some money into the TCC Foundation or or other charities within combined fund drive. You'd be able to add a deduction here and set it up and uh, and then it would be processed through HR. So you'll be able to kind of do that in a digital way uh, through the PeopleSoft environment. So these are just a couple of tools. Um, I'll try to showcase some more uh, as we have additional video blogs uh, since we, and we only have three and a half months left, so there probably won't be too many of those. But, um, but I will showcase different aspects of the system. And then also we will have some sessions on campus where we'll be able to um, you know, showcase or demo different aspects of the system once we get more data in our sandbox environments. So that's really all I have uh, for today. I hope everybody has a great weekend and see you next time.